Outside of this chamber, the passage leading back to the surface has been opened for you. Return with Zathrian as soon as you can. The passage just outside of this room is open to you now, and it will lead you. Here you are already. You have carved a safe path through the forest. Safe enough for me to follow, anyhow. <laughs> he wishes to see if we did his work for him. Is that not why you were here now, sorcerer? Do not call me that, witch. I am keeper of this clan, and have done what I must. Did you acquire the heart? You didn't. May I ask then, why are you leaving the ruin? You do understand that she actually is Witherfang? She is the powerful spirit of this ancient forest that I summoned long ago and bound in the body of the wolf. Her nature is that of the forest itself. Beautiful and terrible, serene and savage, maiden and beast. She is the lady and Witherfang both. Two sides of a single being. The curse came first from her. Those she afflicted with it mirrored her own nature, becoming savage beast as well as human. I find that difficult to believe. They attacked my clan, and they were the same savages then that they have ever been. They deserve to be wiped out and not defended. Come. I will accompany you back to the ruin. Let us go and speak to the spirit, and I will force her into Witherfang's form. He may then be slain and the heart taken. Why? You claim they have regained their minds, but they are still savage beasts. Their nature is unchanged. All they want is revenge, or a release that I will not give them. No, let us take the heart and end it. No, Witherfang's heart will cure the hunters, but it does not end the curse. The curse is more powerful than that. And even if I could, I would not break the curse. These savage beasts deserve their existence. I will do nothing to help them. Ever. You were not there. You did not see what... What, what they did to my son. To my daughter. And so many others. You are not Dalish. How can you know how we had to struggle to be safe? How could I have let their crimes go unanswered? I remember them as if it were yesterday. Even if they are more than animals now, they desire nothing but revenge. 
They will never let my plan be. And what if it is revenge they want, and not talk? Will you safeguard me from harm? I fail to see the purpose behind this, but very well. It has been many centuries now. Let us see what the spirit has to say. So here you are, spirit. She is the Lady of the Forest! You will address her properly! You've taken a name, spirit? And you've given names to your pets? These beasts who follow you? It was they who gave me a name, Zathrian. And the names they take are their own. They follow me because I help them to find who they are. Who they are has not changed from whom their ancestors were. Wild savages, worthless dogs. Their twisted shape only mirrors their monstrous hearts. He will not help us, lady. It is as I warned you. He is not here to talk. No, I am here to talk, though I see little point in it. We all know where this will lead. Your nature compels it, as does mine. It does not have to be that way. There is room in your heart for compassion, Zathrian. Surely your retribution is spent. My retribution is eternal, spirit, as is my pain. This is justice, no more. Are you certain your pain is the only reason you will not end this curse? Have you told the mortal how it was created? This is an old forest mortal, and I am its spirit, its heart. I was not summoned from across the veil, but pulled from the trees, the rock, and soil. I was bound to the body of the great wolf, Witherfang. Not possessed, like a sylvan or the undead, but bound into one being. Such powerful magic, however, could not be accomplished without Zathrian's blood. The curse and his life are intertwined. Your people believe you have rediscovered the immortality of their ancestors, Zathrian, but that is not true. So long as the curse exists, so do you. No! That is not how it is! What could keep one going after so many centuries of life? Love? Or a bitter hatred that clutches at a heart that should long ago have ceased beating? The curse would not end with Zathrian's death. His life, however, relies on its existence. And I believe his death plays a part in its ending. Then we kill him! We tear him apart now! For all your powers of speech, you are beasts still. What would you gain from killing me? Only I know how the ritual ends, and I will never do it. Ha! You see? We must kill them all! See? They turn on you as quickly. Do what you have come here to do, Grey Warden, or get out of my way! <laughs> 